Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the motion tracking in Filmora 11. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to use the motion tracking feature and also how to, uh, to add a text to follow the subject like what you have just seen at the beginning of the tutorial. Okay, so, and if you don't have Filmora 11 yet, I will put the link in the description for you to download it and also my 20% discount coupon code to save your money. Okay, be sure to check out the description. Let's go to my computer screen. Alright, so this is my Filmora 11 and this is the clip that I'm going to use as, a, as an example. Alright, so I have a video here on the timeline. And first up, if you want to do the motion tracking, make sure that you split the clip at the position you want to do the motion tracking. Because the software will try to, to track the object along the clip. So be sure to split the clip first. So I'm going to uh, put the playhead at the position that I want to, to do the motion tracking like this. So I'm going to split right here. So just click this button to split the clip or you can press Ctrl B to split. Uh, it's okay. All right, and then play it. Very nice, right? So I'm going to stop right here. So I'm going to split it again. And now we need to put the playhead at the beginning of this clip, this section. So I'm going to press Shift Home uh, to bring my playhead to the beginning of the uh, of this section. And the next thing we want to select the clip right here, and then we can click this button to activate the motion tracking. Okay. Then we have a tracking point right here, and being mentioned that you have this eye button to hide or unhide the tracking point. Like this, you don't see the tracking point, and you click here to see the tracking point. And if you adjust the tracking point like this and you want to reset it to normal, you can click this button to reset the tracking point to the center. Okay, and now we need to adjust this tracking point to where we want to track. So make sure that your camera is in focus at this position, otherwise it cannot track the object perfectly. Okay, so I'm going to put it at my face right here. And then the next thing, we want to click this button, start tracking. Okay okay and now it is finished finished with the tracking point so we have a tracking data here on the timeline and if you want to adjust something you can just uh, go to that position and then you can adjust the tracking point right here and with it will adjust the keyframe here on the timeline by the way I'm not going to adjust anything okay so the next thing we want to add some text or image or video or anything to this tracking point okay so we can click ok and then we can bring our playhead to the beginning of the clip again so i'm going to press shift home to go go to the beginning of the clip and then i'm going to select my title tab right here and then select work at uh, which is a new folder in Filmora 11.1 so this is the, the update version of Filmora 11 and we have new work at uh, templates right here so i, I think it's very beautiful Okay, so for example, I want to use this one, title number two. So all I need to do is to drag and drop it right here on the timeline. And the next thing, we want to double click at the title box and change it to, uh, I'm sorry, and change it to something we call motion tracking. Okay, so the text is too big. I can change the size to 60, for example. Okay, and let's make it two line right here. So I'm going to select the motion tracking and align center. All right, and the next thing we want to click OK. And now go back to the clip. So just double click at the clip again and select the motion tracking right here and select the menu right here. So we have a drop down menu. We can select this title template. OK, and the next thing you want to adjust the title position on the screen to where you want to put it right here very nice right and then we can click ok and now we finish with the motion tracking and this is the result let's play it very nice right and actually you can and actually you can also add text or video or anything like that to this tracking point that is how to use the motion tracking in Filmora 11 I think it's simple and interesting i hope this tutorial is helpful for you if you have any more questions just let me know in the comment section below 
Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!